Hello everybody and welcome back to Charlotte and Zeke play Pokemon Soul Silver. There's a new rule. Literally never use escape ropes ever again. That uh, might also happen with flying, we don't know. If it happens with flying, <laughs> I I'm gonna be so sad. I'm just flying them we're screwed. But yeah, we decided you know, we walked out here, had a battle, did nothing, so we reset the emulator and all is good. Yeah, the battle screen itself was fine, but the overworld was still completely black. Yeah, not really what we're after. Nah. <laughs> right, I'm thinking we take on the gym. You ready for the gym? Oh, we can see how Summer does in the gym. I think we'll be okay. What's this? Ooh. Yeah. I, I don't remember this. Why is there a dollar sign? It's always been a dollar sign. I can't believe how ridiculously high up this is. From but blah, blah, blah. but from up here you can tell what it feels like to be a bird Pokemon. Let me see if you're good enough to face Faulkner. What are you talking about? Hey man, I just got this little sheep here. <laughs> bird keep Abe sent out Spearow. Spearow. I do like Spearow. It's an eager little face. That's not me. No, no, I don't think the mouse has been captured. Good. But yeah, in case the other episode didn't give it away, we have to use an emulator. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes the emulator does that, I suppose. <laughs> oh well. That had to have been an emulation bug. I mean, I don't think it was coded into the game. Well, no, I don't oh. think it was a feature. Otherwise, that happened to Silver as well. Oh, we can just shortcut straight there. Yeah, but we want to fight trainers. Yeah, we want EXP. Yeah, the dollar sign gym floor. Ho ho. <laughs> you some kind of big shot? We'll see. What happens if? What happens if you get pushed around up here? I think you'll. St what? What happens if you get pushed around up here? I think you'll stagger and fall. Yeah, but like. Dude, don't! Yeah. People are training night and day to become bird Pokemon masters. Bring it on! So if you lose, he's gonna push you off. I think that's what he said. Damn it, Rod! <laughs> it's Pidgey. It's a level level Pidgey than Spirit. He's been training day and night to get that Pidgey to level 7. He's just been fighting, like, Caterpie outside, and that's it. No, he's no, he's not been fighting anything. He's been in the gym, day and night, mm. where there's no wild encounters. And he's already fought the other guy. Yeah, he's just been fighting the other guy and getting his ass beat. <laughs> and then fighting Faulkner, and giving him all his money while he loses. <laughs> that boss is really rich. <laughs> I don't know why. It doesn't even matter how hard I try. Oh. Yeah. Right. Ooh. This sheep is pretty good. Mm. But Faulkner is also pretty good. Quick, push him! <laughs> to the ground! <laughs> kick, 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 kick. Get him, Reap. What does even Reap say about Tackle. being up here? Are you happy? <laughs> Very eager. Eager. Give him a push. Yeah, good effort. Thank you. I did my best. Um, I'll, I'll go heal what little damage Marith has taken. Well, we don't need to heal. Okay. Got that massive dollar sign on the floor. <laughs> money, money, money. Running, running, running away. Hello. So. Oh, so we're going to be coming up to the area you catch Wooper soon. Yes. What are you going to do? Because I know how much you like Wooper. I love me a Wooper. But I... your half of the team is full. Yeah, I'm torn. Like, I might catch one for the just-in-case. Oh, just put it in the box. Yeah. Yeah, because you're totally okay to do that. <laughs> I kind of wish there was a little sort of, like, jump at the end. Oh, you just went boop in the air. Yeah. Alright, do I save? Nah, screw it, we'll win. Will we? Well, if we don't, I'm blaming you because you're playing. People say you 
say you can clap. Clip. Clip. Fly into that Pokemon's wings with a jolt of electricity. Do you like my sheep? <laughs> <laughs> I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of the magnificent bird Pokemon. Such power. Wow. He looked like he was holding a puppet, but... Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> wow, such power. <laughs> wow, well, nice. So pidgey, much power. So pidgey, much shock. Oh, oh no. screw a Ground you. attack! Art Marie has a really bad history of accuracy <laughs> anyway. Especially on the first turn. Yeah. Oh, well, it's dead. Yep. Hey. Oh, and a level up. You're going down, Birdman. Geodo. Excuse me, I was just getting a drink. Oh, here <laughs> he just is. slides in behind me. <laughs> I'm still here. The wind is finally with us. It's not though. You haven't used Tailwind. And he's fucked. <laughs> and we missed. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Good old summer. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey. Oh, we got this. Not if we miss. We can still fly. Can't you can't be paralyzed. People say you can clip Pokemon's wings with jolts of electricity. No, you can't! Shut up! <laughs> See? It isn't working! <laughs> it never works! I think it's working pretty well. Yeah, we won. <laughs> Hooray! He hit us, like, twice. If one of those was a sand attack. Whoa! Nice. Maripo P. I love it. Yeah, I told you. Well, half the team is the best team. To be honest, I probably would have taken the Mareep if you didn't. Yeah. I like Mareep. It's a official League badge. This one is a Zephyr badge. Our Mareep is just bouncing. <laughs> it's so happy he got to be a murderer. Okay, we're not really going to have many traded Pokemon, probably. Probably not. Oh no. yeah, Rock Smash. Cool. And we don't have anyone that can learn that yet, do we? No. We might need a flying type. Unless fly crashes the game like an escape rope. We have a flying type. Oh, hop it. Yeah. Yeah, but you can't fly on it. Oh. 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 We have a phone call. Hello, Cheek. We've discovered something. The details are... Well, I can't really say anything, but we want you to carry that egg. My assistant is at the Pokemart in Violet City. Could you go meet him and pick up that egg? Click! <laughs> I wish you'd stop saying click uh, after every conversation. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to use one of my slots to carry this egg with us. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay, sweet. Thank you. But why? I guess that's what your mother's doing with the money. This is from Professor L. The thing is, we would like you to take care of this of an egg. Yes. Yeah, give it to the person travelling around in the wilderness. After you left, Professor L received a phone call. I have no idea what they were talking about. But after a while, Professor Elm suddenly cried out, I can't think of anyone more suited than Cheek. Then he insisted that I hand this egg to you. That's how I came here, to deliver the egg to you. I don't care! Riveting story! It seems that a Pokemon will hatch from it only when you keep it in your party of Pokemon. That's another reason we've chosen you, Cheek. You're the only person we know with Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, we researched them, but they're not ours. <laughs> Get a look at that egg. Oh. Oh, it's a kimono. Oh, me oh my. That egg must be. Get away from my egg. See, so it was handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm, and then from Professor Elm to you. I mean, you missed a few steps, but yeah. Yeah, you missed all the steps about the phone call, and I was really excited. <laughs> that egg is truly an important egg. Please do take care of it for me. Is that understood? When was this your I'm egg? I'm counting on you. Go away! Weirdo. Who talks to this fat man? Oops. 
<laughs> There's a large, formidable tree. Yes. Ah, very nice indeed. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Right, let's go heal and look at our egg. Okay. Cannot have your Pokemon out walking with you in some places. Places like buildings, caves, and where there are huge crabs. But all you have to do is put it in its Pokeball. Oh, yeah. Okay, neat. So, I mean, spoiler alert, it's a Togepi egg. No spoilers! I've spoiled it. No! Oh no! I didn't know. Um, it's not different in this game, is it? No, no, it's no. definitely Togepi. Yeah. Definitely. Because, like, the Daycat Man still gives you an egg, doesn't he? Does he? I thought he does. I don't know. Oh. Look at the damn egg! I want to see it! No! <laughs> Oops. That's the wrong button. <laughs> button, button, button. Egg. There's your precious egg. The egg watch. <laughs> <laughs> Why does it say that? I don't know. It appears to move occasionally. It may be close to hatching. Cool. Neato. Yeah. Right, I like Togepi an awful lot. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I'll use it, but that egg will certainly be one of my... It'll be on the team until it hatches, at least. Okay, that's completely the wrong direction. Oh uh, yeah, now we're, now we're on to the next uh, route, I suppose. Well, now it's dark. I'm assuming the Gastlys are about... <clears throat> you want them? Hmm. Cotton is poking at your feet. Stay with my feet. Okay. Let's, go, let's go catch a Gastly. I don't know if I want one, but let's go catch one. Okay. Do you want to get news rocks, man? Uh, no. <clears throat> no, I think it's too ethereal for that. Oh, I'm scared. It's gonna break again. No, just don't escape rope. Oh, they're not there yet. Oh. It's not late enough. Okay. Oh, okay. Never mind then. Because you said they'll sh they'll show up in that art. Yeah. Well, when it's actually like dark, dark, that art changes and gasoline's there. Okay, I guess they're not there for. It's just gone seven o'clock IRL, so they're probably not there till eight. Eight. <laughs> She contained the yellow apricot. All right. Oh, we're gonna get an item from this balding man. Oh no! Wait up! What's the hurry? I'll get Whooper. You have some good Pokemon there. Thank you. That must be from the training you gave them around Violet City. You know it. The training at the gym must have been especially helpful for one of them. Yeah, it was more the Sprout Tower, really. As a souvenir of Violet City, take this. It increases the power of grass type moves. Sweet! I thought the. You know, seeing how the gyms are flat. Whatever. Yeah. It's the only reason the gym leader's not a Bell Sprout user is because, like, the Sprout Tower was there, and then someone moved in with a Pidgey, and they were just <laughs> like, we cannot compete! Yeah. <laughs> okay. We're gonna start finding some new. Oh. It's a new Joey. I haven't seen you around before, so you think you're pretty tough? I'm the toughest! I'm the toughest thing, a lie eye. Albert. Albert! He can really move! Albert! He surf Batman! Albert! Wow, Charlotte. <laughs> Bravo! I have no rhythm or no rhyme. That sounded pretty rhythmic when, <laughs> when you were, Same you know, putting yourself one. down. I specialise in one genre, self-depreciation. Mmm, I'm good at it. Yeah. Well. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that tickled you. <laughs> no, don't tickle. Okay. Never do it again. Alright. Hey, Zubit. Zubit, not in the cave. I'll be training up your cry day before you. Thank you. Again, I really like Zubat, but I used one in Crystal recently in my own time. I, I just don't want to do it again. I will just use the same... I'll use half of my party that I liked the best, but again. Oh. Scratch. Don't supersonic me. It's not happening. I mean, to be fair, in that playthrough, I did use... A centro for a good while. Yeah, he did. But he eventually got boxed because I got a shiny Jigglypuff. 
tree looks like it could be cut down. Well, it's a shame I can't cut anything. What's in the grass? Here we go. It's a... Uh, ooh! Ooh! I want it. You want it? I've never used an Ekins. Okay. Um, probably swing. <laughs> uh, let's send out Marie. It might paralyse it. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I thought I could tackle it, because that wouldn't do too much. Yeah. I mean... Mmm, a delicious wrap. Hey, it's paralyzed. Hey. I think it's got shed skin. I've got the ball with it. I mean, it's a pretty low level. Yeah, give it a... Yeah. Oh! <laughs> how dare you? You growl. Why? Because then it can hit me again. Get paralyzed again. <gasps> Don't you dare. Come. Oh, man, poison and Yeah, let's just throw something at it. What have we got? Rocks. Hit it with a rock. Yeah. Mm -hmm. bing, bing, bing. Okay, we gotta hurt it. Yeah. Excuse me. Mm. I had a drink and my drink's low and the straw went. Don't kill it. I used the straw because it was like, oh, that won't really pick up on the microphone, and then it went. Like, oh, it's really picking up on the microphone. Oh, no, it's really picking up on the mic. Use a heal ball. Oh. Oh, sorry. Never mind. If this one doesn't work, I'll use a heal ball. Cool. So we don't have to go to a Pokemon Center. <gasps> hey! Hey, yeah! Got a snake. What are you going to call it? Don't know. Cool. Let's read about it, and maybe it'll inspire me. Ooh. Ekin's data was added to the Pokedex. It always hides in grass. When first born, it has no poison. So its bite is painful, but harmless. Oh, well mine's level 4, so it's probably terrible. Yeah. How... It's 6 foot tall and 7 inches. That's pretty tall. He's taller than me. He's taller than me. Uh, hmm. He only weighs 15 pounds? I guess he's just long. Oh, that'd be 15 stone 2 pounds, wouldn't it? Is it pound? No, 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 it's... It's pounds and ounces, isn't it? It's just pounds. It's 15.2 pounds. That's really light for something that's six foot. It's a snake. Right. It doesn't have any limbs. It's like it's lost a lot of weight that way. <laughs> yeah, let's nickname Ekins. Ooh, he looks weird there. <laughs> His eyes are like glowing. Come get me. Man, what do you call an amazingly big snake? Uh... uh... How about we call it... Oh, I know something. Mm. I want to call it... Um, I, I don't know what to call... I know what I want to call it, but I don't quite know how to word it. I want it to be something like cable or cord. You know, one of those things that just gets tangled up. Right. Like a Christmas tree light or something. <sighs> Head... I don't want it all caps, but headphones is fine. Okay. Sweet. No, 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 I've got a better one. I've got a better one. Pass me the controller. There you go. I'm going to call you... Um... Yeah, that's A. I'm going to call you... Fah. It's rude. <laughs> Just fat. <laughs> fat. Fat beat. Fat beats. Oh, fat beats. Fat beats inspired by headphones. Oh. Cool. Right, I want to have a look at this bad boy. It's a girl. Three <laughs> fat beats. Oh, it's quiet. Because oh, it's because it's, it's, it's headphones. You can't hear it. It's often lost in thought as well. Shed skin, crap clear, and poison stang. So up in its special attack and lowering its defense. Lowering its speed. Yeah, speed. I can't read. Yeah, red is going up, blue is going down. Mm. So that's why if you look at this dude, you can see red is going up, blue is going down. He's got the same nature as that. Oh, cool. 
<laughs> or your nah, team's nah. going to have the same nature. That's your team. I thought you were comparing it to Sentra. No, no, no. It and it and Summer. Oh, okay. Fat Beats and Summer. Oh, yeah. Fat Beats in the Summer. Fat Beats. What a terrible <laughs> name. What would you call it for me? I don't know. Right. Shut up. Before we explore the grass anymore, we say we call it. Okay, cool. Uh, by the time we record the next one, we'll have healed everyone up and we'll be back down here. Yaha! Why the hell did you sound like Mickey Mouse? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm leaving. Bye-bye. Okay, cool. See you later, everyone! Bye-bye! <laughs>